Hi guys, so today I am here uh, for a very special occasion. I'm here at Proton City Tanjong Malim to witness the start of the uh, X70 CKD production as you can see right here with the sign. Okay, and uh, well, actually I do have a bit of time early. So what I'm going to do is, uh, before the event starts, I'm just going to take you guys on a tour around this very extensive and very expensively built Proton City. Now I remember back in what, sometime around 2000, year 2000, uh, Proton spent a lot of money, there was a lot of hoo-ha on the construction of this Proton City. In fact, the narrative of this place um, sort of attempted to draw comparisons with uh, with that of Toyota, the famous Toyota City in Japan. Okay, now this, uh, as we are driving here, this is Gate 3. This looks like an obviously a more restricted area. So yeah, I'm not going to go in there, but uh, right over there on my left, I am seeing like a sports complex. Okay, now back there from gate 3, I'm seeing all these uh, trucks going in and out. So, okay, now let's see. Uh, we just stopped by this road sign here behind me. Uh, so it says, okay, to the right is where I came from. To the left is trim and final, painting, body assembly, stamping, engine and transmission. So that's where we'll be headed for the event. Okay, this is a, see this is a nice long straight road up there. Let me just look at the sign. Okay, all right. Okay, so back there, uh, based on the signboard that I'm looking from the back, that side is uh, the trim shop, the paint shop and all that. Okay, so right here, uh, this is this is a beautiful view actually. Nice long straight road, uh, fully enclosed space. I know some of you are thinking drag race, drag race, drag race now, right? Uh, yeah, got to hold that tall off because I don't think I don't think the people inside here are in any ways expecting uh, high speed traffic. So the event is further ahead, but I'm just going to detour here to the left, and I find myself. Uh, driving into a dead end but still let me just swing my car about and show you a full view of this right now I come back out to the same main road as I was on before Driving still slowly and look at that building to the left. Okay, that I think is uh, that perhaps that could be the corporate building. The last time I came here, uh, it was to attend the launch of the Iris. So I'm just going to take a stop here and show you the uh, signboard here. So it says left to trim and final painting, body assembly, stamping, uh, as well as uh, engine and transmission area. So we'll move on. Ah, what some of my media friends brought one of my media friends turning up in the new mini Clubman test car, I reckon. So I'm just gonna detour we're off here as well. Alright, so there it says uh, restricted area. Alright, so I'm just gonna turn back again. We're not going to go anywhere where we are not wanted of course so come back out and continue on our straight road iris launch last time i was here was for the iris launch that was what? How many years ago was the Iris launch? 2014. Five years ago. This place actually, uh, it is, well, considering how long it has been in operation, right, and 
the supposed significance of this place it is rather quiet now i'm supposed to turn left for the event venue but never mind that i'm going to push on straight uh, and show you a bit more of this place first still got a bit of time so you see this is like a vast area and uh, right in front there to the right we can see some terrace houses so the original concept of this proton city is that this is supposed this was supposed to have been a self-sustaining township where all where they house all of protons uh vendors suppliers staff here all right uh within a community of them uh of on its own Okay, so I'm going to make a left turn here. Now, to my right, uh, I'm seeing some other slightly more upper end houses. I'll show you later on in the video. Where is this place? Wow, this looks like I look like I'm veering off beyond the. The, uh, the civilized part of the city. This could well be a dead end. Oh no, it's not. I am led uh, to another another housing community. Nice quiet uh, community here. Let me just. All right. So, ah, <laughs> looks like a nice place to raise kids. All right. Uh, so, just now, uh, just now over there were terrace houses. This, to my left here. All right. You can see this is a mosque and. Up here, these are some of the more, um, these are some of the bigger, nicer homes. Kind of remind me of uh, of the Bukit Jelutong area in Shah Alam, actually. Yeah. So it's got a, uh, uh, got a daycare there. Children, it looks like a kid's daycare. That corner house behind me now. This is a mosque. Okay, so that if you have in front of me, that's a nice uh, big field there. See people playing cricket. Okay, so more terrace houses to my left up there. All right, uh, I think that's those are shop lots up ahead. All right, yeah, shop lots. Glen Mary Sales Gallery. Okay, uh, we've got a 99 speed mart here. There's no entry, uh, one way street. Oh, so here also got uh, got apartments or flats here somewhere. So it's a very, uh, if you talk about in terms of residential area, uh, it's a fairly complete development with uh, various tiers. Uh, and types of properties. Just wonder how much do house prices here go for? There's a mama to the right there. I think that was where I had breakfast uh, the last time I came here for the Iris launch. So in front there, there's a nice, nice large field there. more houses so yeah it, but actually honestly right i mean people a lot, of, a lot of people say this place is a failure but one thing i will say it looks like a pretty pleasant place to stay all right i mean now i am approaching this area where uh the houses 
I've grown progressively bigger and nicer. And they even have something like this of a, you know, like a, like a gated community arch. Very nice. Okay, this was where I made a left turn earlier. So now I am going to make a right. Now to the left is uh, are more houses, and to the right, uh, what look looks it what looks uh. I see what looks like a factory building. So this is presumably where uh, where the supposed concept of having the the suppliers right, in in proximity uh, nearby. This is what they what they this area to my right here is what they had in mind. Now, uh, of course, not too long ago, uh, Perodua actually uh, did something here. They actually. Uh, got a supplier to open up a plant here uh, to manufacture parts for discontinued models which I think it's a uh, it's a fantastic move on Pro Duo's part fantastic gesture uh, one takes care of all old Pro Duo owners and two uh, it actually adds value to this to this place okay now i'm going to try a u-turn okay go up this flyover see where this leads me i'm trying to find my way back to that factory there but wait what's this to my left here okay this here is uh University, they have a university here, University Pendidikan Sultan Idris. Okay, so I'm not going to go in there. Uh, let's wait for the bus, the cars to pass and make a U turn. So they've got a university in here as well. Right. nice long stretch of road and uh, we are approaching the cross junction that I turned just now all right so if you look at if you are approaching from here the clear the, the demarcation is very clear to the left is basically where people stay sorry to the right is where people stay and to the left where I'm turning now is where people work and right now at right now when you're seeing the some some construction here on the left maybe there is another new plan of some sort coming up here uh, I see a turning there I'm gonna turn in here okay so here this place is uh, it's it, the name is self descriptive it's called Wender Park so this is where all the Wenders are placed right now to my right here is Tuopu it's a Chinese company, Tuopu, or well, whatever they call it. Uh, let's see what's here on this left. Here you have Lear Automotive. This is a, well, yeah, Lear Automotive component manufacturer. Uh, some more, what else? Up ahead. We've got IQM Sindrian Berhad, manufacturer of plastic and metal components.
so not exactly bustling with activity but well things are happening here and here I see some bumpers lying up there I can't tell from this angle what bumpers they are but well this is the bumper vendor Tycom Taxi Manufacturing and I mean and, and it's spelled T-E-C-K space S-E-E -E. okay, not taxi you know the taxi that you ride in uh, that's Deloitte uh, this is Deloitte of course is a major supplier to Proton Supplies uh, a whole bunch of uh, various parts that's Post Logistics well to handle delivery of, of, uh, of things and documents here I presume right so uh it's 4 20 now i think it's the it's about just the right time for me to head to the uh event venue right so right here to the right is miyazu steering tomorrow's technology maybe that's the power steering supplier right the street lane it's a tmb substation there so there's there are more facilities more vendors uh, based uh, to the left of where I am Automotive Industry Sandhya Berhad on the left there So that's the event location. Wow, another mini test car. That is the JC Clubman JCW. Nice. Who's driving that? I wonder. So okay, to the left here. Well, here we are. Start of production. Parking for guests. Yep, I think that's the building where I came for the. For the iris launch all those years back okay so here we are this is the uh is this is i think the main hall is it the main hall well this could be this is probably the main hall or events building well, but anyways guys hope you enjoyed this uh brief little tour of uh of the proton city here in tanjung malim uh do catch uh, I'll be producing, of course. Okay, so uh, so as you know, so as I stated earlier, uh, the purpose of my being here today is to attend the uh, launch of the X70 CKD. Now, the invitation there states that it is a no-camera affair. So really, at this point in time, I'm not sure what sort of video output or or whatever output that coverage output that I'll be producing for this event. But either ways, there will be some updates on, in some form or, in, or another, either uh, on my channel here again, or on Horizons Facebook, or on evomalaysia.com, which by now, by this, by the time I edit this video out, you would have seen it already. Okay, so thanks for watching, guys. Cheers.